My weaknesses are that I uh, cry too easily. <laughs> Hi everyone, this is Dr. Wallace. Today I'm gonna ask you, what are your weaknesses in your relationships? <laughs> too many. I don't know. Um, let me think. <laughs> Do I have any? <laughs> I'm a really big uh, people pleaser and I've been trying to work on that, but I feel like I end up losing my own identity and other people. Giving too much of yourself away can be detrimental to a relationship because you always have to put your own oxygen mask on first. For a long time, I've been so interested in being accepted and liked that I'll change who I am depending on who I'm with. I didn't know much about setting my own boundaries until recently and it's still something I'm working on a lot. I have a big heart and I really care. And so I think that sometimes leads me to trouble where I'm just exhausted because all I ever want to do is help other people. Mm -hmm. um, and so I end up like going above and beyond maybe for people that don't reciprocate it back. Like time and time again, this happens where I get bit back by, by almost doing too much and then being let down. Um, but maybe them not doing nearly as much for me as I had done for them. My weaknesses are that I uh, cry too easily <laughs> and um, I, uh, despite what I just said about feeling like I can trust him with anything, I have trust issues. So I always think something's going on. What are your weaknesses in your relationships? We can talk about today. <laughs> oh yes, I have very, very, very bad patience, very bad tempo and I don't want to lower my protection. Like a hatchet when they get attacked, they roll over and they the, the pokey thing come out. Mm -hmm. Hedgehog. Hedgehog. Yeah. <laughs> I need a translation here. Yeah. <laughs> I really strive to be authentic with myself and how I feel. So being um, inauthentic can be a weakness for sure. Miscommunication, that's like the biggest like weakness, probably in almost every single relationship. There will be miscommunications, you'll say something, two people interpret it differently, um, and it's about how effectively you can communicate. So I think my biggest weakness is talking too much about it. So even when I know that I should not be talking about it, or it's if it's something on the back of my head, I need to get it out. So I never really have any limiter to stop me, which is, I guess, the worst part about it. Yeah. Weakness, maybe it's... I'm unpredictable. Like one day I make, I may say, yeah, I want to go to Hawaii. Yeah. And then sometimes my girlfriend convinces me not to do that. But sometimes I just say, let's book the ticket to Hawaii and then just go. There's a lot of things she loves to do that I don't. And quite often if she wants to go do those things, I really do not. Such a like dance. Dance or <laughs> taking pictures or things like that. It's, I really actually do not enjoy those things at all. And so Quite often, I find it very, very difficult to agree to participate in those activities. Or even, you know, we're out and about and she wants to take a picture or something, I'll complain. Blah, can we just enjoy the, the scenery, just enjoy the experience? <laughs> so that's something I would say I, I, I definitely have room to improve on. <laughs> My main weakness is uh, impatient and getting angry really fast. My weakness is fear and um, wanting to change everybody and everything, to, to force everybody, uh, progress, healing, it's like I'm taking their own will because I want to see a better world, a better place. These are not questions that are going to endanger our relationship, right?